Hey guys, so we're going to back with another video and today we're going to be talking about a brand new game that has just soft launched in the Philippines. Now, I heard about this game from my friend Valor because other than that, this game has been a ghost. The devs haven't said anything about this game. They just recently opened their Facebook page and their Discord, which I will link down in the description because you guys, I highly, highly recommend you join the Discord because this game is soft launched. There has been no previous beta. They're going to take as much feedback as possible before it goes global. All right. So this game is called Battle Prime. Now, it's very strange in terms of the monetization, but the gameplay is pretty damn sweet. So let's talk about this game for a little bit. And then, of course, I'll show you guys some gameplay. Now, you do not need a VPN to play this game, uh, but I recommend you do because you do you do get hella lag if you're not like near the Philippines or in the Philippines. All right. So this game is a third person shooter. Um, it does become a first person when you aim down sights. Um, and this game is all about the primes, which are essentially specialists. So I have played 15 games. I have won all of them and I have unlocked three characters. So I have shock. Vityaz and Vision. Now each one of these have their own specific sort of weapons as well as some sort of ability. So for Shock, this is the first character you unlock. Start off with the MK16 with an SMG as a secondary and his ability is he throws a grenade that causes a temporary shell shock. Um, which is pretty nice. Now the thing about the monetization though is if you already look in the bottom right, yes you can upgrade the character's health it does have a maximum, and then the guns as well, you can upgrade as well the damage. Um, and then you do get attachments just by leveling up, as well as supply drops. So yes, there are supply drops in this game. I'll kind of show you how that works in just a little bit. Um, but you can also rank up your helmets as well as your body armor. So there is some sort of progression to it, but you do have to pay with credits. Now, I play 15 games. I think I've only upgraded like four things. So... In 15 games, I've amassed to almost 10k credits, so I think that's a pretty good amount. I mean, for what, how many games I played. Um, the next guy is Vityaz. He has an LMG to start off with and a shotgun. And of course, you can you can change these. Um, some of these you you get by unlocking other specialists or primes, um, as and then some are available in supply drops. Or there is a subscription model to it that if you get the premium, you are able to get this. So. I'll show you guys that also in a little bit. But this guy's specialist ability is he has an extra layer of armor that reduces all damage taken. This lasts for quite a bit. Quite a bit, I'll say that. Um, and then the last one, Vision. You start off with a sniper, SMG, and her ability is she throws a motion sensor, which kind of pings people through walls, um, which lasts very, very little. So this game exactly hasn't really really been balanced so i really highly recommend you guys go to the discord and give some feedback just by play just from playing this game um these are the weapons all in the game at the moment so it's got a pretty nice selection except you probably won't get all the weapons unless you get um the subscription service that you can get um which is right here so lots of benefits with the premium subscription so you unlock a new prime an additional upgrade slot because when you do upgrade something it does have a timer unless you want to skip through that with the prime credits on the top right which you do get just by playing in game um and so you have premium levels so it keeps going you know characters guns attachments all that stuff so and then there are you know supply drops which the one that you can get just by ranking up i think is just usually just attachments uh, but the one you pay for gives you weapons and stuff. So, not sure how this is going to pan out, but hopefully they listen to feedback and kind of fix that all up before it glows global. Um, but uh, other than that, I guess we'll check, lastly, the stats. So, I played 15 games, haven't lost a game yet. Um, there aren't any real people, I don't think, yet, because this game literally just came out. And my friend Valor was like, dude, it just came out. Probably no one's playing this game. Um, like I'm telling you, man, they, these guys were a ghost. They did not promote this at all. It's crazy. And they just soft launched it out of nowhere. So anyways, so 15 games, did not lose the game. I'm level eight. And then there is a ranking system just by playing. So I ran a warrior one from all those games. 
Um, and that you just get points, I believe, just by winning. I don't think it really matters on the amount of score you get. I don't think. Um, so it goes all the way to Legend. So there's that. And then for settings, pretty nice. You can customize your controls. You can customize the shooting modes. There is auto fire. Don't know how exactly how crazy that is. I haven't tried it. Um, sensitivity, as well as you can make it either high graphics with 30 FPS or high FPS, which is 60 FPS. So, anyways, guys, that is the game. I'm going to show you guys some gameplay, and uh, I'll leave all the links to their Discord, Facebook, uh, the Philippines App Store account if you guys want to try it. But, uh, anyways, guys, let's get into the game. All right, guys, here we go. So, the only mode they have is Domination, and I believe they have three or four maps. I'm going to go ahead. Ooh, excuse me. I'm going to go ahead and use um, Shock because I think I'm better with him. Um, the Sniper is okay, just not that good to be honest. Uh, but here's the game, man. I got to say the HUD looks clean as heck. I'll say that. It gives me sort of like a Battlefield kind of vibe. Oh, nope. So these are guys I'm playing against. Probably going to be all bots, man, since no one's playing this game. But, dude, the bots sometimes are so freaking crazy, man. As usually all bots in every game, but. <laughs> dude, I was getting sniped. Look at that, man. It's crazy. It's actually crazy. All right. But anyways, yeah, this is just to give you guys kind of like a brief just glimpse of the gameplay. It is uh, pretty damn nice. Let me go ahead and chunk this really quick. Nice. So once you get that red hit marker, that is basically the kill shot. Nice. And guys, remember, this is on their very own engine. This is not Unity. This is not Unreal. This is literally their very own engine. So you got to give them huge props for that. Wow. All right. Let me try this sniper because I'm pretty sure you guys are interested in that. So this sniper does a good amount of damage. It's usually a two-shot kill, depending on the range. But uh, here we go. That's a fail. Even with headshots, man, not a one-shot. Kind of sucks. But that's how it is. Well, that was not a kill. Let me push up, let me push up, man. So I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna throw it, and that's gonna basically let me see them through walls for a little bit. Q. This guy's gonna rush, isn't he? Watch out, move. Oh, I gotta reload. Hold on. Look at that, dude! It's so crazy how they kill you, the bots. It's actually crazy. Uh, but in terms of the game length, I mean, I think it's a pretty good length. These guys are actually winning right now. That's not good. Hold on. Okay, no, we're fine. We have A and B, so we'll catch up. They only got C. So this is the third one that I've unlocked, which is an LMG as well as a shotgun. the heck okay and this guy's kind of prime ability is that I have like an extra layer of armor that absorbs damage what <laughs> it's so crazy man I'm telling you it's so crazy they might need to lower the freaking aim botness of the bots because it's actually crazy all right Let's push up to be. These guys are winning, and I do not want that. Okay, so I'm gonna activate my armor. Let me go ahead and reload this. All right, so we got A and B. Should be able to catch up with these two. Okay. Might as well also just, I guess, get C. Nice. Wow, do they grab C? Alright, 
Alright, you do move really slow with that ability. What the frick? Alright, let's switch. Hold on a sec, guys. This is actually the closest game I've ever had. So it goes to a thousand. That's the score limit. So we're gonna go. Alright, alright, sweet. We got A, B, and C. I don't need to do anything. My teammates got it. There we go. Now we're winning. Oh, God. Literally no chance, man. Literally no chance. <laughs> what? We're about to win, though. Like, any second now. Alright, yeah, we got A and B, so we're good. Alright. Let me see if I can get one more kill before this game ends. Thank you. Nice. So that's game, guys. Pretty a good amount of time. Uh, you can check the results here. So I got 24 kills, 5 deaths. Not too bad. I did 48,000 damage. So there you guys have it. It gives you level as well as rating. So I got 6 trophies for that. I leveled up. There you guys have it. So the game still a work in progress, but uh, I gotta say, man, in terms of the graphics and just gameplay with their own engine, it's pretty damn good. Pretty damn optimized, pretty damn good. Uh, definitely, guys, give it a try. I will put all the links down in the description. And uh, yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.